Singapore's education ministry is making moves to boost the special education sector. Uh, there will be higher salaries for teachers and two new syllabuses to help students. Sabrina Ng tells us more. This is 10-year-old Dashman's communication board. By pointing to the icons on it, he's able to tell his parents what he needs or how he feels. The St Andrews Autism School student has been learning how to better express himself by using such tools. These communication tools is vital for them because uh, most of them they want to communicate but they have uh, limited verbal skills. So with these communication tools, uh, they are able to let us know uh, what they want, uh, we communicate better, so it really lessens the frustration uh, for them and their loved ones. To equip more special needs students with such critical life skills, the Education Ministry is introducing topics like communications and language and social-emotional learning. These are covered under two new teaching and learning syllabuses. These syllabuses aim to help schools review and redesign their lesson plans. It also aims to promote collaborations between teachers, parents of students with special needs and the community at large. Special Education, or SPED, teachers played a key role in developing the syllabuses. Besides learning how to communicate more effectively, students are also taught goal setting and how to regulate their emotions. Teachers will also use technology in the classroom. Assistive tech has been quite a game changer in our in our industry just because with this assistive technology, whenever you, the student presses a symbol, there's actually a voice output as well. They're actually giving them an opportunity to learn, not only learn but also use that same word or that symbol to communicate with others in the future. To retain and attract teachers in the sector, MOE is raising their salaries by giving more funding to spared schools. I appreciate that the recruitment of SPED educators is not easy. There will be demand for competent teachers in different settings. So therefore, as a fraternity, we need to strengthen ourselves through professional development to stay impactful with these finite resources. More details on the salary enhancements will be announced early next year.